Okay, so now I'm in what we call a bluegrass um, field. So I guess I should say we're called Blue Fox Farms because of this field, which is my favorite area of the farm. And um, there's another field called Fox Field. So this is called the bluegrass, it's called Fox Field. That's where our name came from. Um, I also, it's not the prettiest time of year, but uh, we have a lot of invasives at the farm. Um, it's more of a wildlife refuge, but we still call it the farm. Um, we have a lot of work to do, um, which, you know, that's fun work to me. Um, but we've had emerald ash borer come through and decimated all of our ash trees. So you're gonna see a lot of dead trees um, which is fine. We use that for uh, heat and house, but um, it just decimated the ash and we had a lot of those. You're also going to see um, some elm trees because of the Dutch elm disease um, kills them off um, when they get to be a certain age. So uh, we have a lot of dead uh, lumber. We also have, uh, you'll see these shrubs underneath and they're very invasive, but I have my lonely goat herd that's going to help me with that uh, once I get them out here because they love to eat on this stuff. So they're going to be uh, helping me clean everything up. But why I stopped here is today I'm talking about, um, again, I'm back to the floral decor because I just don't have that herb stuff going yet there's nothing growing um, I wanted to show you how old some of the growth here is that I can harvest from so just to give you an idea you'll see two vines right here in front of me coming out of the ground it looks like a, a you know shrub or something these are great vines and you so you could see it and it goes they're huge and it goes all the way up the tree. You can see it vining through the trees. This isn't good for the trees because it pulls them down. It breaks limbs, um, weighs them down, especially when we have the high winds we've been having. So um, it's not a good thing for them to get this big. It's just how long that this land has been laying here um, doing its own thing and not being maintained. So don't have to worry about ever running out of grapevine to sell. Um, I think that's about it for today. Next week, maybe I'll go inside and show you my shop area.